All right. Uh, we've got some more quick tips here. Kirit brings us a quick tip about accessibility, uh, but a cool use of it. And this is new in, in uh, iOS 16 and Watch OS 9. Uh, if you go to Settings, Accessibility, Apple Watch Mirroring, you can see your watch face magnified on your phone and manipulate it. The usefulness? He says, I don't know. Maybe to learn, teach about more, uh, teach about the watch, to send screenshots, um, more, maybe more features will come. Yeah, this is one of those things that's, I, I, I had the same thought as Kirit when I saw it first. It's like, oh, that's cool. What am I going to use it for? I don't know, but that's cool. I, you know, maybe it's because there has, n there is no way to do this from the iPhone to your Mac, right? Like you can't, you can, you can share like with QuickTime Viewer, maybe and maybe or QuickTime Player, and maybe people don't know that. Uh, you can, if you connect your phone to your Mac, I think it has to be done wired. Uh, I think QuickTime Player, and you create a new movie, and and you can essentially set your iPhone to be the camera for this so you can record you know and and see your phone mirrored on your mac screen but you can't manipulate it there it would be really nice if you could use say screen sharing to control your phone but oh, that's yeah. something apple's never done so maybe that's why i got excited about this because it's like oh this is like screen sharing for the watch you know so yeah i don't know yeah i don't know but it's a cool one